Once upon a time in the heart of ancient China, there lived a sage whose wisdom was admired far and wide. People from distant lands would seek his counsel, knowing that his mind held the power to solve the most difficult problems. One morning, two young men arrived at the sage's humble home for his advice, both courteous and respectful, each insisting that the other should speak first. Yet, as they conversed, they realized that their problems mirrored one another's, and thus they agreed to address the sage together. With grave expressions, they posed their question before the venerable sage. Master, we both work as low-level employees and we are treated really mean at work. We have to work all day from morning till dusk without much break. Our bosses keep saying mean things to us and they don't pay us much salary. Should we leave our jobs and find something else to do? The wise sage closed his eyes and thought deeply. The two young men waited quietly until the sage opened his eyes at last and gave a riddle-like answer with only five words. Only a bowl of rice. Puzzled yet hopeful, the two young men bid the sage farewell and embarked on their journey back to the city. As they traversed winding paths, their thoughts were on the sage's mysterious words. It is as if he spoke in riddles. One of the young men said, breaking the silence that enveloped them. Indeed, his companion agreed, wrinkling his brows in contemplation. But perhaps his message is simpler than we think. Could it be that our jobs are merely a bowl of rice? It only provides our daily meal. A spark of understanding sparkled in their minds as they pondered the sage's words. They each took different paths. One of them felt brave and decided to leave his menial job behind. He said goodbye to the busy city and went to the calm countryside to farm and make a living there. On the other hand, his counterpart interpreted the sage's words in a different way. It made him feel better about his tough job, and he decided to stay in his current job. Years passed. The young man who chose to be a farmer became very successful. He used his knowledge gained in the city to import best seeds from the city and grew the best fruits and vegetables in the whole area. People knew him as an expert farmer, and of course he made a lot of money. The other young man who stayed at work also did great. He became a whole new person. He took more responsibility and started doing hard tasks others hesitated to do. He got promoted year after year until he became the manager of the company. One day they bumped into each other unexpectedly. As they talked and shared their stories, they noticed they had followed different paths, even though they heard the same advice from the sage. Both of them were rich and successful, but they wondered which path was the right one. How strange. The manager scratched his head. The master told us the same thing, and we both heard it the same way. Why did you choose to leave? The farmer was puzzled too. Isn't it obvious? I got it right away. My job meant just a bowl of rice. The job was simply a way to get my daily food. So why stay in such a horrible place just for that? Quitting was the smart choice. Why did you stay? I think it's pretty obvious too. The manager chuckled. My job meant just a bowl of rice. So why get so upset? Once I realized that, I didn't let the bad stuff bother me. I didn't take it personally, so I stayed and worked hard. Wasn't that what the master meant? Confused by the difference in their interpretations, the two men decided to seek clarity from the sage once again, yearning to unravel the puzzle. Upon their return to the sage's sanctuary, they asked him once more, their voices filled with an urgency born of curiosity. Please, master, tell us what you really meant with your advice. We're confused by what you said. With a calm face, the sage closed his eyes again and thought deeply. When he opened them, he gave them a short but important answer, again using only five words. Only a difference of thought. Some people might think this story doesn't end properly. The sage didn't say which path was better. Does that make the story unclear? How can we learn from it? The main thing we learn from this story is that nothing in this world is fixed. Hearing the same five words from the sage, the two young men took totally different paths. One stayed in his job and the other one left. Yet they both achieved what they were looking for, become rich and successful. This shows that everyone has their own way to reach their goals, and even if the paths seem different, they can still lead to the same place. 
The second important lesson is what the sage said with his last five words, only a difference of thought, a small change in how we think can make a huge difference in our life. In this story, both young men made good choices, but with the help of luck. It doesn't mean all paths in life are the same. There are many paths to get where we want to go in life, but equally there are numerous paths take us farther away from our goal. Just one small decision to go left or right along the way can mean the difference between getting to our destination or getting lost in life.